Okay. So once I knew I was doing this and it was youth and truth, uh, I decided to put up uh, an interactive message so that I get uh, representation from the youth as well and get some questions to ask you. A lot of them asked about Atma, some about happiness. And uh, there was a, a overwhelming amount of messages coming, especially from Tamil Nadu, that were asking about uh, the issue of uh, land grabbing uh, near your ashram. And I know that this question has been asked several <laughs> times and I think you have even given an answer. But uh, there is still a feeling that uh, land grabbing has happened and I don't know where this is. I don't know the truth about any of this. I am completely ignorant. I haven't uh, read the actual accusation. They did or not talk about the kidneys. Kidneys, no. Kidney grabbing, they didn't talk. Kidney grabbing, no. no. They've, been, they've been going on with kidney grabbing for some time because it didn't work. Now they've come to land grabbing in the last three years. Oh, it's been The going last on twenty-five since three years, years, some campaign is going okay. that I've killed hundred elephants. Okay. Ra <laughs> raised out a full rainforest. Nobody knows where the rainforest is. And I killed hundred elephants with just my bare hands. And I pull kidneys out, you better check it out, you might have lost one <laughs> And this land grab. I've said this openly, I shouldn't say it too often, but because you're saying uh, young people from Tamil Nadu are asking, I'll invite these young people, your fans, ask them to make a group of whatever, ten, twenty people okay. who are very smart. Okay. Let them come with all the maps and uh, panchayat documents, everything. Anywhere, either private land, government land, forest land, one inch, not one acre, one inch if Isha Foundation has grabbed one inch of land. This is the last you'll see of me, I'll leave the country. How… is that good enough? <laughs> so, I'll… I'll I, I'm this saying… Will... No, I'm saying this is going on like this. People said, they campaigned, they made videos of how elephants are dying in the ashram, okay? okay? All animated videos were made. They said full forest was removed. Then we put out the Google Maps. The land was not in our hands in 2006, it was somebody else's land. Later on we bought it, Two, from 2006 onwards there are Google Maps. We put out the Google Maps, it shows it's barren land. No vegetation? No. And you see the Google Maps from 2006 to now, has vegetation gone up or gone down? Well, before that there were no Google Maps. Check the panchayat records. All the survey numbers that we own today, just check the panchayat rep records from 1994 since we own these lands. What were the crops before 1994? Was that forest? Was it even trees? Or was it crops, dry crops, mostly? Well, check the panthayat records, don't go by what I say. But without checking, young people, if they are interested in truth or they are interested in just slander, you have done enough slander, United Nations recognizes me as the ecological champion in the world, okay? We are part of their uh, program. We have the highest ecological award in the country, Indira Gandhi Paryavaran Puraskar. Wildlife Trust of India says that not an inch has been taken. Forest Department in Tamil Nadu says there is absolutely no encroachment. Ministry of Environment and Forest says there is no encroachment anywhere, nor are we in any way obstructing any wildlife. In, in fact, we've blocked all the hunters and others and uh, sandalwood cutters and everybody, so we've made enemies, of course. We made enemies from vested interests. And they're going on for last twenty-five years. Young people must be interested in truth. I will open all the records. Panchayat is there, forget about my records. I'll open the gates of ashram for you to come and stay there for a week and investigate everything. Talk to all the agencies concerned. If one inch is taken, only one inch, if it's taken, I'll leave. Is that good enough for the young people? Have all these been put out? The UN Everything UNESCO is there the... on the website. Okay, oh, all the documents… Yes, everything is there, out. this just goes on, simply because it's a motivated media. Anonymous media on the social media thing, they just go on saying the same things. 
So if they're genuine, if these fans of yours are genuine youth concerned about the ecology, concerned about justice in Tamil Nadu, please let them come and investigate whichever way they want. I'll open the entire document segment, it's all digitized our documents, we'll open the entire thing, you can look at it, then go and refer to it in the panchayat documents, that is also reasonably digitized. If there is any encroachment, please show me. All agencies have found there is no encroachment, and above all, am I interested in a stupid piece of land <laughs> that you have? This is because certain people want access to the forest and we are sitting there as a block, because it's at the tri-junction. Oh, tri-junction. Tri-junction means three state borders are there, there is certain activity going on. It is those people who are carrying on this campaign endlessly. And uh, why, you know, ask the police, ask the police what all they've been doing, because they want access to the jungle. Because it has resources? Ah, uh, no, they have their own other agendas. But if there is a really interested bunch of kids who really want to know and they can spread I'm the word… I'm telling you, I will get right now I will keep you as the contact. If there are ten, fifteen people, sensible people who have some knowledge about yeah. this, want to come and examine, I'll do it. But after that, you and your fans must openly speak, this is absolute rubbish. They will, these ten, fifteen and… Please? It, yeah, they will. Please do that, no? <laughs> if there are interesting It will save a lot of time and energy for me answering this idiotic stuff all the time. Yeah. I think we could have done… if this wasn't an issue, we could have done one other question… Yes. Instead of this. Life is going waste because it's going on like this, the same thing. The people... Why I'm speaking like this is because young people who are with me, these are not people who come for money, these are volunteers. They came in their twenties and they worked hard to build this entire thing. You must come and see what we have built. In the world, it's one of the unique places that we have built on the planet. People are coming from across the world today and it's appreciated everywhere in the country. It is on the Incredible India campaign, but these people are unhappy. I will tell you to what extent they're prejudiced. A group of government officials come for inspection, all right, including the collector. So one official says, they have built a factory shed without permission. Uh, Isha. Yes, Visha has okay. built. So, we ask, where is the factory shed? We have not built anything. He points at Adiyogi statue and says, this is a factory shed. The collector asks, what is this? You're calling Adiyogi as factory shed? He says, I am… as far as I am concerned, it's a factory shed because inside it has steel structure, outside it has sheet metal, it's a factory shed. You've seen the Adiyogi statue? I've seen The pictures. images? Yeah. Looking at the Adiyogi statue, if you're calling it a factory shed, just tell me who is this man? <laughs> we have permission for a monument, we build a monument, but that guy wants to categorize Adiyogi… Adiyogi statue as a factory shed and put some case on us. Tell me who, you must think through this politi politically, who is calling Adiyogi as a factory shed? So this is what young people are being influenced by, please come and examine if you want. Whatever you want, all right? Done, and fifteen years ago, how the mountain was, today how it is, how green it is… There are images. Oh, please check it out, no, don't believe me. The entire mountain has turned green. Who did it? You think all these idiots who are writing nonsense did it? Millions of trees have gone up on the mountain. Who did it? Please check it out. People ask, where is the proof you planted? Well, go walk into the mountain and see all the trees are eighteen, twenty years old. That doesn't happen in a forest, isn't it? In a rainforest, if you find except bamboo, all the trees are eighteen, twenty years old. Somebody must have put it, isn't it? You don't want to give me the credit, leave it. Somebody put it eighteen, twenty years ago after we came. Maybe I didn't do it, Shiva did it, it's okay. <laughs> it's fine. We are not asking for credit, we are happy it's green. But I hope that this issue clears out and everyone… No, no, this issue answer. will never clear out. At least for the non-motivated, because I've seen that seeing this discussion, people who are not motivated also tend to take sides, as in… No, this news I'm saying this are... issue will never clear because they will come up with new things and new things all the time. Otherwise, they'll go on saying it because these are people 
This is a Nazi mindset. They believe that if they tell a lie hundred times, it'll become true. Unfortunately, in this country they've learned that. So, if these youth, we are talking youth and truth, if they're interested in truth, let them take a week off, come and examine every document, every survey stone around the boundary. If one inch is there, I will leave. Can you will never cameras? see me again. Huh? Can they you bring can bring cameras? cameras, please. Okay. You can bring cameras, I will set up a team to take you around, which is all our property. If we have occupied any forest land, as you're claiming, you will not see me again. Is that good enough? Then I'll let them know. <laughs> Thank you. Thank you so much, Sadhguru. Mm. Please uh, take care, there is something that you need to handle right now.